What's good everyone, it's your man Busy Brown, we are here with another reaction, so here we are with episode 9, so I think we're branding through these, I think we're doing a decent job, so I mean, we started this last week, and I mean, it took me a little bit, I had a friend come over between like the, the first couple of days of the beginning of the week, so I mean, those three days I got like not much done, I mean, when people are over I get really distracted, and that's just the bottom line, so I do want to apologize for that, but we are on a roll, we are trying to finish this, I just reacted to episode 8, and I'm like, you know what, I got time, let's get in episode 9, this is titled Prom, when the Dean begins a new investigation and threatens to cancel Prom, the friends decide to confide in their parents, but not about everything, so last episode was insane, man, we had so much stuff go on, and just such, you know, like, just... In, in, in an hour, just so much went down. That's the bottom line. Um, we had hate for Diego, but then Diego kind of uh, started being a little so-so because, I mean, he kind of stood up for Justice, Justin in a way, and then he ended up finding out. I guess he, he is assuming that Jessica has more to do with the, the murder than um, most people know. So, I mean, he's getting a little... little a little more curious, I guess, and uh, we had that big brawl, the riot, you know, a lot of stuff went down, it was just very exciting, you know, and um, I'm, I'm really excited to see how it's gonna end, because of course, this show has changed everything, you know, I feel like shows to come in the future, they might end up showing a lot more due to this show, this show kind of went out there and did what not many things, not many sh shows had, like, I don't want to say had the balls for it, but just, just not what they did, you know, this show just came out here and just, just, sh had the freedom, you know, just didn't hold back. And I know some people might have not enjoyed that, but I feel like for some people, the visuals helped them or, or got them to actually know how serious some of these topics are, you know? And it's just, I mean, I don't know, take it as you will, but I mean, I, 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 I've enjoyed this show. I mean, I've started, I started watching it when it first dropped. I mean, I wasn't one of those people that hopped on the bandwagon. I was watching this before I reacted or made reviews. I, I just started watching it and I, I enjoyed it, you know? And, um, it was just very real because, I mean, I've had people around me that have had some problems and it's just, it, it's good to know these things. That's the bottom line. So it's, um, this show is just, it's really powerful and it sucks that we only have two episodes left, but within this last episode, this is a normal type of episode. We have an hour of this and the next episode should be an hour and 40 minutes long which is going to be crazy but yeah i'm looking forward to it so i mean what do you guys think is going down how do you guys think it's gonna go you know like just talk to me in the comments and i'm excited to hear what your favorite part of the episode is that's that's just the bottom line i mean hopefully tony goes to college i'm looking forward to that i know college isn't for any everybody but i mean i feel like tony he'd He'd excel. He'd do a hell of a job, you know, with that, especially going for fighting. I mean, I'm looking forward to it. And I, I want to get at least one more fight with Tony. That's it. And um, Justin, I mean, I, I'm hoping he stops with the drugs because, I mean, it looked like he was doing it again last episode. And um, then he seemed to, after after the fight with the cops, he looked a little more, you know, calm when he was talking to Diego. So if that's the case. Zach is going absolute nuts. He needs to get his stuff together to stop being a, a little reckless bastard because, you know, football isn't it. You know, man, you're a smart guy. Like, they were talking about how he was a straight-A student. So football wasn't the only thing he could back up to. And, I mean, now he's almost close to repeating the 12th grade. And now we have Clay, who's still kind of going nuts. I thought he was getting a little better. But we find out that this dude's been doing so, so much crazy stuff. You know, he... he is the one who lit the car on fire. He wrote Monty his friend. He's been scaring himself by riding up on the on the ceiling. Like this dude doesn't even know what's going on, and the fact that he's blacking out just makes him a danger to himself and others. And that's what the therapist was trying to highlight during their meeting. So hopefully they get their stuff, you know, out of the way. And I'm really anxious to find out how this is going to, you know, end. And um, Ani, I'm hoping she ends up taking the money. I know a lot of people aren't gonna feel that way, but I mean, obviously some people like the money wise, like it could be a struggle. College is a pain. So I mean, if if you got if you got the resources, you know, take it, take advantage of the opportunity obviously the person you're getting it from does not have a good you know sh like the street cred is not great especially her kid i mean that obviously didn't end well but hopefully ani takes it and hopefully jessica's not a an ass about it and we still have two episodes left so jessica can hopefully redeem herself to me because i've not liked her this much this season you know i don't know it's just me um, i don't maybe i have some other some of you in the comment section were telling me that she was also being annoying to you so it made me feel a little good that i wasn't the only one just getting a little bothered by her but yeah we have so much to go over and again um like yeah hopefully she she redeems herself i mean that's that's basically it we'll see what's going on we got two episodes left so let's finish strong remember if you're new to the channel subscribe follow my socials if you guys follow my socials and talk to me in the um the the comments of whatever post i had to say oh yeah i just followed you i'll make sure to say thank you i love talking to you guys it's my favorite thing to do we should get a stream the next couple of days we'll talk about this show or any show you want i'm gonna shut up remember subscribe follow me i hope you guys are doing well 
Let's get busy. God, so they're officially together now? Maybe we could do more than just literally sleep together. Yes, we will someday. Jeez, right the jail sub guy. All right, so it's not in trouble. Destroying all my personal Jesus, possessions dude. wasn't enough to work it all out. We still have to make it up at the end of the year. Oh, they closed the school, so they, I guess they did something right now. <laughs> Jesus. Or some shit. And Justin. I haven't used in days. You told me you were <sighs> not. Like, I, I don't know, they have like addiction doctors? I don't want to spend any more of your parents' money. But we should do something. Come on, I don't dude, want they're trying to know I relapsed. The instigators and those responsible for the most damage. Oh, crap. But why are you suspended Zach a week? Please. Why Clay Jensen's destroying security cameras? Jesus, What's dude. really going on here? You escape with your life only to go join a riot and assault a cop. Yeah, I can you understand his frustration. Go, so <laughs> telling me. Don't you have to open the job? Come on, Tony. That's funny. I gotta tell Justin. Don't you fucking... Whoa. Jesus, dude. Oh, shit, sure you about to catch the hands. Enough. That's true to make them trust us. Alright, that makes sense. Here. We care about prom. Why? Yeah, me too. Yeah? <laughs> For whatever you think I did with Diego. But you pushed me away. Oh, you wouldn't let me stop help it. You. Then you gave up on yourself. Again and again. You're the again, she didn't even take full responsibility. She's like, oh, sorry for whatever you think I did. I don't know. You're so angry with me. Edmund Fitzgerald. Man, got tight. I think you know that's gotten us nowhere. That's that's fair. fair. I've been using it again. Yeah, I got <sighs> from Dude, for stealing money to buy. Justin. Justin. I'm not using right now. You guys back. He's Justin. trying hard. I'll give him that. You need to know. So another riot? <laughs> no. No, it's nothing. I'm not any person. Oh, so it's. Oh, dude. Um. Bisexual. Like, What's the matter? Yeah. What do you mean, yeah? He knew? I mean, and he's so proud. By not being straight. By being yourself. <laughs> Alright, see, that's the father oh, wait, right wait, there. Wait, what did you Doesn't mean? matter, dude. I yeah. like that. Did you know? I. Uh, I could sense that you were figuring something out about your sexuality. How? Just watching you, living with you. But like what? Specifically. Dude well, needs to know. <laughs> no self-respecting middle school quarterback is that big a fan of Eli Manning. <laughs> he has two super borings. He got them almost by accident. <laughs> Man, the Patriots are still a goat. Than completions. <laughs> you had Eli Manning wallpaper. He was a quarterback. He was shirtless. He's very handsome. He absolutely is. Oh, this is great. But I'm from New England, so you guys know who I represent. These meetings when you're off at college. Drew? Gary. Oh, Gary. I'm going to start calling you Gary. Good to see you again, Charlie. All right. Like steak? Yes, sir. You're dating the fucking quarterback? Sweet. You and I have fought like lovers. Now, I've talked sex with you. Oh my god, Ani. Oh yeah? <laughs> oh, is Charlie doing this? Bro, hey Alex, hey Alex, will you look? <laughs> oh, he's not paying attention! What is... I don't... <laughs> Oh, She's Hannah. So beautiful. Nah, go to prom with me. Okay, Tyler. Prom, as in, like, like senior prom. Yeah. Okay, no, Tyler. Right, yeah. Weird. Hell yes. I'll go to senior prom with you. Okay. <laughs> oh, I love it. Now you gotta pay attention, guy. <laughs> oh, that's just creepy. <laughs> Come on, man. Oh. Go to prom with me. Hey! <laughs> well, you wanna say yes, bro? <laughs> so... Come on, dude. Charlie got an eight person limo. Is it somewhat gay that you're going with the two of them? <laughs> Who all three should get married? As oh, a yeah? poly thing? 
<laughs> I don't mean that in any sort of insensitive. The girls are looking good. They just, I just think you all three they look adorable. looking good. Besides, I think we have some competition for the oh, hottest yeah? couple right here. <laughs> Definitely a hooker. Oh my god, dude. <laughs> oh, and we stop agreeing. Alright, Jessica, you've been playing him this whole time, and like, oh, yeah. you act like he has I no right to get tonight. a little upset. And you'll leave alone. And is he actually gonna show up? Wrong. <laughs> She's probably a drug addict. She is an escort who is escorting me. He didn't deserve to die. Jesus, dude. I'm go dance with a whore. Hey, hey. Oh no. Monty. Oh, <laughs> dude. Poor Winston, bro. Why is this so sad? Like, I, I, I didn't like Monty. <laughs> and Winston's a better pain in the ass. <laughs> hey, he's going. Let's go, bud. Jesus, Zach. The prom king and queen are. Or. King and king. Oh, yeah? Or it's Alex Standall and Charlie Saint. Wait, why Alex? I don't know who wants the tiara. <laughs> I think I'd like the small one. Okay. <laughs> I love how excited the football team is for them. Fuck it. We're dancing. What? I oh, yeah? I'm proud of those two boys. Oh, yeah? <laughs> and now I realize I'm a little bit jealous. <laughs> hey, Justin. Me and don't ever let me go. Oh, yep. oh she's such a happy parent. You saw her. I would have thought you'd be here with her tonight. Uh, no. Go dance with your mom. <laughs> I would love to dance. Oh. <laughs> no, Cap. These are the two best actors here for season four. You know, call, call me out. <laughs> Prom cakes. We're gonna happen. Expected to us too. There you are, guys. This is my husband Josh? Oh yeah. George, Alex Standle. Well, That's awesome. Congratulations. That kind of caught me off guard. <laughs> like it, them, them too. <laughs> Boundaries, gay. <laughs> Mind, no. Later, we Jeez, just dude. kept dancing <laughs> and dancing. Oh, what the hell? What the hell? What the hell? Oh god, dude. He was just gonna collapse like. <sighs> but, like. <sighs> okay. Alright. Alright, now I'm, I'm, a, I'm a little upset right now, okay? Um, first off, let's start by saying. I don't even know where to start. So Alex and Charlie are now prom king and king. Um, Justin just passed out. Jesus, dude. And he was just talking about like getting sober and all that stuff. So this is, this is frustrating, man. I, I don't even know what to say. Um, they keep pushing for Tony to go to, um, to, to college. Jesus, I don't, I can't talk for real. Cause I, I just, I'm not, I wasn't ready for that to happen. I just wasn't, that's just, okay. Uh, alright, 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 all right, all right, I'm ready, I'm ready. So Clay ended up getting a dance with his mom. Him and Ani are just becoming friends. Jessica still being a pain in the ass, but she was a little better this episode, I guess, kind of. Um, she acted like Diego had no reason to get pissed. Of course, Diego was a little aggressive when he was talking to, to her, but it was just, I don't know, it was just... I don't know what to think about this. Man, I'm so pissed. We got one more episode after this and we should, we're, we're done. So I'm gonna try, I think I'm gonna try to film it right away because I really want to figure out what goes on, what's gonna happen. I want to see what, Jesus, I'm, <laughs> okay. So we end up finding out that I think the Dean, um, he is, he's gay. We didn't know that. So it was like, it caught me off guard because at first he was like talking to them. He was like, he's like, oh yeah, that would have never happened in my day. I was like, all right, man, all right. Take it down a notch, and then he pulls out his husband. I was like, "Oh, okay, that that's pretty cool." So, I mean, it would it's probably a, a cool sight to see. I do like how all the parents seem to be cool with him being um, with Charlie and Al um, Alex being um, gay. So it was pretty cool. Or and well, Charlie's bi. So it was cool that everyone was accepting with that. Diego, I mean, is still a little butthurt about Justin going with Jessica. So we got a lot of stuff to deal with. I'm gonna go 
I, I really want to check out the last episode. We got one episode left, and I should be good. Remember, guys, if you're new, follow my socials. I know you guys might just be here for 13 Reasons Why, but that one subscription really does wonders. You have no idea that the numbers really do add up. So, I mean, if you guys can help me out with that, it'd really mean a lot, you know? And, um, man, I'm really, like, butthurt about finding out the whole Justin thing. Alright guys, if you <laughs> I'm like I was just getting way too emotional. Even when Winston was talking to the ghost of Monty, I mean that shit was getting me emotional too. But again, thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys are doing well. I hope you guys are staying safe and I'll talk to you guys next time. Subscribe, follow my socials, let's get those numbers up. Talk to you next time. Peace.